to NXT No Mercy Commentary. I am Slim, joined by Kyle. Hello, Kyle. Hola. And I am your commentary champion. Yes. Until now. Probably not. Right. North America title to kick this show off. Who do you have? Over Femi. Over Femi? Both? Yeah. He hasn't lost a match that we've recorded, I don't think. Yeah, I don't know. Like, like ever, I don't think. Yeah. Well, I'm going to take Tony D. Or both? No. Just for him, yeah. Because... Over winning in real life, <laughs> but I'm taking him in game because I don't know if you know this or not. But uh, the Don has three managers. Well, Ober's that good that he'll beat them too. <laughs> Overall spinning power bomb then too. <laughs> Don is ready for another championship. He recently lost the Heritage Cup and now it's just down to the North The actual America. belt. Yeah. And there he is. Oba Femi. It's not a bad call. And it looks like he's wearing the Ulafala. <laughs> He is the trouble chief. Yeah, I was going to say, he's the trouble chief. Oh, yeah. Oprah Femi makes his way into the ring. This entrance is quite long, isn't it? <laughs> Meanwhile, while watching uh, AW All In, Chris Jericho is making his entrance and he is singing. Yes, he does sing. Yes. Did you see that Jericho and Swerve were doing um, the show together? Yeah. Yeah, look, they, yeah, they, yeah, um, yeah, so I'm killing in the name off together, didn't they? Yeah. You couldn't hear Swerve. Nah. Oh. Imagine Arba Femi and Bron Breaker's tag team. God. That would be dominant. And the match is off, and there's a big flying back elbow to Arba. No. Tony Day using his quickness to get out of the way of Femi. Big splash. And over with the tower. Big back elbows. Ooh. 
And a big clothesline rocks him, takes him down. Suplex. Cover. Rope break. Yeah, hey. These referees don't like rope breaks as we saw in the um, Fashion Berlin box. No suplex. Showstopper style elbow drop. And there's another one. Tony D's had the majority of this match. He has. I don't think that's going to be the case in real life, though. No, probably not. Ooh. went over with Eddie debuted it was really funny they had these promo packages for him and you know how they lead it up and you know debuts next week and whatnot mm. they did that he debuts and then for like months he's just not on tv <laughs> yeah right and until, it? so it was like six months or something he, he won the breakout tournament didn't he yeah he debuted then for six months did nothing then won the breakout tournament <laughs> Right. So he, he didn't have to win the breakout tournament. He could have just, you know, been winning. <laughs> it would have been fine. Yeah. They could have used the breakout tournament for somebody else. Then he's got Tony D stunned. Not great for me. Although we're saying that none of the managers have done anything at this time. Good. I need to get as many points early on. It's possible for us to tie here too. Six match? Yeah, six matches. Yeah. So we can just pick different on the mold and tie. Oh, the pin looking at the managers. Tony D out at one. Tony D retreating. Used, used the managers as a shield and then took it to over. Big German suplex dropped him on the top of his head. On the outside. Bolded him. Bolded him. Uh... Yeah. Back into the ring. Tony D going up. Oh, that worked. Nice northern lights. Forget about it. Can Could, Could be. be. I don't know. He's going no. forget about it now. And he's hit. stunned, so he's going to hit it. Well, let's not forget about it, but that's a move. Is that enough? Does he have a chance? Tony D! Oh, damn it. Here is your winner,
Well, I got a point for that, even though my reasoning was completely wrong. <laughs> you just won clean. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that happens. Anyway, we'll be back with the next match after this break. And we're back with the Women's North American Championship, from one North American Championship to the other. Here we go. Ant retained yet again. These are both cores, aren't they? What was that? These are both cores, aren't they? Yes. No, no, Wendy's not. I think Wendy Chu is going to win in game and Kalani Jordan's going to retain in real life. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go Kalani for both. Although this Wendy Chu is completely different to the one in real life. Very true. I. I've never liked this character. It looks so dumb. Yeah. Like, <laughs> she, she, she's tired all the time? Except when the bell rings? Yeah. Like, that makes no sense. But, anyway. Here comes Kalani. Solid looking belt. Mm. It's also a custom belt too. And of course that wasn't in the game either. Yeah, true. Uh, when do you reckon the next game will come out? What month? Has it been coming out in March? Or is it coming out in October? Well, it, recently it's been coming out in March or April. Probably here, yeah, Feb March. Yeah. I'm not sure if it will come out in March or if it will come out in April, but. Does this year come out in March, but last year it come out in April, I'm pretty sure. Probably around the same time. Yeah. Introducing the challenger from Chinatown, New York, Wendy Chu! And her opponent from Florida, the Expected Women Northern Champion. Yeah. Alrighty. And we're off. Wendy immediately with Arakara. Not so sleepy now. No. And a moon song, at least. Come on in. Just taking it down, any means necessary. Neck breaker thing. Splash missed. Here they drop. Nice elbow drop. Bring more back up there. Eh? 
Over the top, Randy Chu's been eliminated. Eliminated from the rumble. Kick. Back in the ring. Wendy knowing she can't win the belt on the outside. Springboard drop kick. Thumbs up. Missed the drop kick. Went a little bit early there. Jawbreaker. Corner of the leg. There's the moon sump. She went for it earlier and now she's connected. My face chop. Another one blocked though. What's this? Okay. Not enough to keep the money there. You. Oh, brain buster! And Kaladi immediately kicks her in the head and gets up. Stops the knee into the canvas. And again. Wendy. Both of them back in the room. For a pin, nothing now. Okay. Jumps of push ups. Impressive. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Off the ropes, drop down. Got kick and missed. No. I guess with more than four on the elbow, but. Oh, nice. Blighter. A lot has happened in this match. Still only two stars. Then. Oh! Oh, missed the bar. Going for. I reckon that's a signature. That was MVP's move, wasn't it? Yeah. That was an awful move. It's known as. Randy Orton used to do it as well before he adopted the RKO. He called Terrible. it the Overdrive. I'm pretty sure MVP called it the Playmaker. And then MVP also had the ball and elbow, which took about seven years to get. Yeah, that was cool. Simone Rock. Close one. Wendy, carrying it up. What does she want? Rainsaw? No. What, <laughs> what was flash. that? And doesn't quite oh. hit the win. Inverted what? That looks so stupid. Yeah, I know. It's like... If you went for... Like when AJ used to do that inverted 450. Yeah. AJ. Yeah, did AJ do it? No. No, but Mustafa Ali. Mustafa Ali did it. Yeah, that looks... That's what it was. Just looks weird. <laughs> Oh, 
She just had the start and the finish. She just didn't do the 450 in the middle. Yeah. Allow you to the top. There's a 450 that missed. Oh. That missed. Into the ropes. Drop toe hole. Tapping the arm. Nope, Wendy out of it. Out of that. They're going reversal for a reversal. Yeah, it's gone from a two match, two star to oh, almost. Oh. MVP, ball on. Kick out. Not quite. Yeah, it went from two two stars to almost four stars. Very quickly. Yeah. That's what I was saying. Like, it's been going for a long time, and it's only a two star match. <laughs> but they've now hit some finishes and signatures, so that's up to. Oh, nice rolling monkey flip. Alani is going to the top. Is she going to go for that 450 again? Yep. yep. And she hits it. Is that it? No! Thank Not God. quite. That was a close kick out. And now watch like a, you know, kick will end the match. Up the top. Oh, flying close line. Kane-esque. <laughs> Gotta win if it's like that then. Yeah. Mira Knox County, Glenn Jacobs. Yeah. What's she going for? Big splash. Goes for a pin. That's got to be it. That is. Damn it. Here is your winner, I believe I'm up 2 0. Yup. If I win this next match, I can't lose. Yep. Yep. Even if we top, like, even if we both go the same for the next match, I can't lose. You we can't go, to go different for the next three. But if we win, if both of us go the same and it wins. Oh, yes. Yeah, because yeah, you'd lose. be three. Yeah. yeah. So we'll be back for the next match after this word from our non existent sponsors. And we're back with the next match for the NXT Tag Team Championships. NXT. Alright, well, he's Axiom, making an entrance by himself. Axiom! Well, who are you picking in this match then? You can go first. I think... I think I'm going to take champions to retain in both. I definitely think they're going to retain in real life. Yep. And I'm taking uh, Axiom and Nathan Fraser to pick up the winning game. Okay. I, I was debating which one to go with, but I'm going to take the champions just because they've got no interest. Not that it mattered the last time, but... <laughs> 
that that's what threw me off. I'm thinking, I'm like, they, they had managers and that didn't factor into the finish. So. It didn't matter. So is it going to matter this time? But, yeah, just, I don't know. But we'll see what happens. Ax Axiom's going to win. Champions. One half of Chase U and one half of the Brawling Brutes. Mm -hmm. well, no. <laughs> <laughs> that means um, that Duke Hudson and Butch could should fight them. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers and a combined weight of 330. The team of Axiom and Nathan Fraser. And the opponents at a combined weight of 469 pounds. The NXT Tag Team Champions, Andre Chase and Rich Holland Chase Union. Here we go. Axiom for the win. Not nice and early, Axiom. Don't break you, oh my god. <laughs> Tremendo DDT. And tags in Fraser instantly. Andre Chase not doing too well there. But he bloody loses something. It's a nice transition into a busting yep. grab. Hey, it's legendary difficulty. He could tap there. The only time legendary difficulty doesn't lose on just regular moves is when you're playing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice big boot. Tag the ridge. Ridge the fridge. Oh! -ho! Do you remember the Kings of NXT? What do you mean? The faction, the Kings of NXT. No. The Pat McAfee's faction. No. And they had war games against Undisputed Era. Oh, I watched the match, but I didn't know who they like what they were doing. Yeah, who was it? it was Pat Ridge, Arnie Lork, and Danny Birch and Pete Dunne, wasn't it? Yeah, probably. That sounds right. Yeah, and I reckon that Pete Dunne got brought in after Ridge got injured. Yeah. And I reckon Ridge at the time wasn't even Ridge Holland; he was um, Luke Menzies still. But he uh, only one Lork and yeah, cult hero. <laughs> Only Lorcan. What was his name? I think his name was Biff Busick or something. Yeah, Biff 
Biff, Biff Bruick or? Yeah, Busick or something, yeah. Something like that. Tag to action. He's now training at the performance center as a trainer. Axiom is? No. Or Arnie. Arnie. Yeah. Oh, hot tag. And nothing's happening. <laughs> that was a very, very great hot tag. Nothing happened. Get around the pit breaker. I can't handle that. Takes him down. Going after the leg, trying to figure out the speed and agility. Moon's out of my moon smash fly. Immediately kicks out. Tag to Fraser. Close line over the top rope. He's been eliminated from the Rumble. Down goes uh, Ridge. Ridge has been eliminated from the Rumble too. No, he never went over the top. He's already out there though. Yeah, but he never went over the top, so he's not in there. You don't oh, know, he could have great car lead over the top rope to get to the corner. <laughs> um, Duke just distracted Fraser. It didn't really help, but the managers have played a factor in this match. Yeah. In the corner. Tag to Axiom. The challenges are keeping each other fresh. There's a nice kit. Atomic drop. Actually, I believe that one was a Manhattan drop. Standing shooting stuff. Oh, us. nice. Bridge in. Oh, that was cool. Drop him. Late drop. Yeah, it's actually, um... And a roll-up! And the referee might have just tossed Ridge the, the win there. In the corner and throwing him away. It's actually in that. Oh, Halo! Doesn't take Ridge down though. He stayed up. Yeah. What a slam. Ridge showing off that power. Agony on the top. Goes for a pin. It's two cow. Axiom out of that. Andre went for a cheap shot. Missed. Another Spanish fly from Axiom. Trying to make it over to Fraser. And he does. Four up. Moonsault. Stunner takes Andre off the apron. Rich has a finisher. Uh oh. Just swing it in by the head. Oh. 
Crazy but out of that. I couldn't oh, escape that. Oh, oh, that was cool. Yeah. Axiom broke it up. Means that Axiom can't get back in the ring now. Oh, roll up! Not immediately out of it. Nope. Ridge is very hard to take off his feet, apparently. Are looking for. Rolls through. Up. Shift flex into. Twisting neck breaker. Andre Chase now in the ring breaks that up immediately. Neither man has a partner until now. But Axiom now has a partner. And he's probably going to hit a gold ratio. Over the top. Come on, excellent. Bridge is now better than that. Fraser and Axiom can do it here. And they will. Yep, there we go. Chase is stunned, but he also can't get back in the ring. There's a Tope Suicida! Shooting star press it outside. Back into the ring. Tag to Fraser. He's going up. Chase still can't get in the ring. Swanton missed. Oh, what? Don't tag, Ridge. Make a tag. Don't tag, no. Into the corner. Doesn't want to tag. Oh, we're pretty. Just throw him all the way across the ring. Tag to Axiom. Ridge is doing a Rusev celebration. Yeah. Come on, Axiom. Oh, nice T bone suplex. Swinging Fraser. Bridge being a one man ring. Golden ratio. Golden ratio! Yes! But it didn't take him down. <laughs> Why is he standing up? Just roll him up. Just roll him up. Pin him There pin, we go. There we go. <laughs> You should have just rolled him up from yeah. there. And that's it. Yes! Still in it. You're still in it. But there's still three more opportunities for me to win. <laughs> Best comeback of all time is on. <laughs> Fraser got busted open at some point, too. Alright, we'll be back with the next match after this break. And we're back with a grudge match. Oops. NXT and A. Yeah. Who do you have? Uh, in real life, Wesley. Uh, in game, the opposite of whoever you pick. <laughs> so probably Zachary Wentz. Okay. If I'm, cause I'm assuming you're going to take Wesley. Yeah. I got West both. And I forgot to write it down. Who did you have in the tank on that? In real life? Chase, Chase you will win. Retain. Yeah. I like how Wentz has Wesley's entrance. 
Yeah, this call is pretty sick, though. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good call. I'm surprised that we haven't seen anything with um, Trey. Hmm. Worse. Yeah. Alrighty. So. But yeah, I, I get the feeling that West will probably win and that'll lead to something with Trey. But yeah. maybe he just keeps bashing him after the match or something, or that's when Trey comes out and stops it. But yeah, it's weird that it's just like he turned on both. And he's having and a match with one of them. Yeah. But I know that you don't want to do a triple threat or something, but we just haven't seen Trey full stop. <laughs> However, I could see it happen in that Trey returns and toss Wes. Nah, I think Wes win him. Yeah, so do I. Because he's only just turned here, so you don't want to go through the short part. Hmm. Yeah. Of course, we're recording this before NXT this week, so it could all bloody change. Absolutely. But we'll see what happens. Oh, European uppercut. Quick match at the gate, you know what? Wentz obviously a little bit upset. Oh, nice corkscrew! Expect to pass past you. That right. Dive, takes him down. Hip up. Elbow onto the apron and swings him into the steel beams on the ring. The steel beams under the ring. I said it Nice German. I want to talk about something, but I don't really want to give away any spoilers to all in for those that haven't seen it yet. So I'm going to put it this way. Kyle, do you think that entrant number three in the Gauntlet match is going to continue wrestling after this match? Negative. No? No, I reckon that's it. It's a, it's a once-off. It'll be a... I mean, it may be, but... Yeah. I doubt it. Yeah. Just a special thing for for the Ook fans. Yep. Yeah. Oh, nice springboard <laughs> hurricane around there for the race. Andre. What's he going for here? Destroyer? Destroyer! Goes for a pin. pin. Grab enough? the rope. Ref, don't see it. Match ends. <laughs> Ooh. Right, we're two. Nice springboard shooting star. I think it was actually just a springboard moonsault, but it turned into a shooting star.
off the ropes. Drop down. Leap frog. Hurricane. Been a lot of hurricane rounds this match. Absolutely. Brain Buster. T on the apron. I think Wesley's done more damage to Wentz than Wentz done to Wesley in this match. Probably it's been pretty, pretty one-sided, really. Yeah, quite. I mean, just based on the power bomb of the apron and then swinging him into the beams and then that DDT on the apron. Double drop to the back. Some big kicks by Wentz. Is he going coast to coast? Hit you. Coast to coast connect. I was hoping that Wes would get up and just spear him. <laughs> that was an awesome spot. Oh. Huge tope through the bottom. Destroyer? On the outside! Oh Out of that, like, destroy it back. What <laughs> this is AW, yeah. <laughs> Wet Spot do this, they both got finishes. That's the second destroyer Wentz is here. Yes, 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 yes. Ooh. Entrance six just came out. I can't remember who they are now. That's Not exactly. They don't have. They don't have numbers. No. Looks like it. Um. I don't want to give it away. But... Also from the UK. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah I can't remember. Oh, oh! nice. Vintage Randy Orton. Yeah. Off the top of rope. Go for the cardiac kick, come on! It's going up. Big missile drop kick. He wants him up. Puts him in the corner. There we go. Cardiac kick! Draw! Oh. That's a super Get him! Get out! Oh! This has been an insane match! Oh my god. He's out! Spiral tap! Is that enough to what went away? No! Oh. I'm still in it. <laughs> We're not worthy chance from the crowd, I agree. And how is this match only four stars? <laughs> I think by the time we get a couple more, we get a finish, so it'll probably be close to five. Yeah. Where's taunting that could be what costs him here? Misses that drop kick. Wentz with a suplex. Another suplex, that one more of a snap suplex. Oh, 
I'm not allowed to do plants, then hold on to the bridge. Oh! Bless! With a quick run and a get back on top. Doesn't want it. It's a tiger driver down on him. There's another rhino type move and a kick to put Wentz back on top. Going after the arm. Oh, this isn't good for Wes. Yes, yes. Wait. Just don't be too far Mr. away. Mr. Swan Dog! Surely he's got a standing finisher. BFT? Yeah! On! And that's it! You're right! Holy shit, that Two was a pace. Up. Two apiece. Comeback is on. Imagine if you win this next one and then I win just the tie at the end. Just for us to tie, yeah. yeah. Technically, I would win the comeback. Because if I if I win the next if I win the next one, then we have you have to go different for either of us to win. Like, yeah. Because even if you go the same as me in the last one, then I'll still be one up. Yeah. All right, that was an instant classic, and we'll be back with the next match after this break. And we're back with the NXT Women's Championship match. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Women's Championship! Who do you have winning this match? Um... I forget who's in it. Roxanne against... Jada Parker. Roxanne will retain in real life. Yep. And... I'm guessing you're going to pick her in the game. Perhaps. So the opposite of whoever you pick. <laughs> well, that's just leaving me to pick Roxanne. Like, if you want to pick Roxanne, I'll go the opposite. I think Roxanne's going to win in game two. Yeah. So do I. Uh, I asked you, so you can have Roxanne, I'll take Jada. Okay. Which will look good if Jada wins. Yeah. Do you have Roxanne in real life, though? Yeah, of course. I think that we're setting up somebody showing up to... Um, Challenge Roxanne, and it'll be one of three people. It'll be either Julia, Stephanie McGraw, or Delta. Becky Lynch. <laughs> Charlotte Flair. Yeah, Charlotte. <laughs> oh, and here comes Cowboy Shit. Cowboy Shit. Roxanne with the belt. In the game, she's still a baby face. Back there. I, I'm pretty sure, not entirely certain, but I'm pretty sure that Julia is set to show up at this show. Oh, yes. So I'd imagine that it'll be after this match. That she shows up. And she'll be the one to take off the next scene. Introducing the challenger from Boca Raton, Florida, the Superstar. The Superstar, yeah. And her opponent from Laredo, Texas, the NXT Women. Champion, 
That's what they're fighting over. My commentary belt is what we're fighting over. Oh shit, that was a cool dead eye. Oh, Jada! Immediately oh, the clothesline. Here comes Jeff Jarrett. Double knees at the back. Elbow, wrist. Looks in with a kick to the guts. She's just course big. Yeah. Oh, nice flying for me. Fisherman Buster. 4-2. It's not on. It's not on this early. <laughs> hey, some matches are over this point. Half and half, reversed. Nice. Yes, very good. Very good, very yeah, nice. Very right. good, very nice. Roxanne thrown back in. She went halfway across the room. Nice punch to the just saw an Australian flag in the background of MJF vs. Will Ospreay. <laughs> Go over to the back there. Okay, I don't know what that move's called. But... I don't know what that is, but it's not going to win in the title. <laughs> it was oh. close, though. <sighs> it was a signature. God damn it. She wants a finisher. Out of that. Yes. He's here. The big surprise. The big man. Yeah. Well, not really. Ew. Yeah. <laughs> Hot yes. rocks! Yes, 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 yes. Pin! Pinner! Pinner, you She's stupid bitch! One, two, what? only two! Oh. Come on, Jaina! Fight forever, chance. Arcarana. Top kick to the head. Yep. Now one. Now two. Oh. Now two. Let's <laughs> take them. Going after the lead. Now, Roxanne really slowing this match down a bit. She's just, she's just getting her breath back. Missed. They both get back into the ring at the same time. Roxanne went for something, but Jada just grabbed it. Some jabs and some kicks. A 
Let's stay dry. Ooh. Come back! <laughs> she gets it. European uppercut. Jacob rolling out of the bottom rope. Sam put him to the outside. Oh, she got caught. And slammed. Here comes the winner. That's all right. Just give us some time to rest. That's good. Okay. Jane to the outside. I mean, I know that Jane can't win by count out. Well, she can, but she can't win the belt. But I, win still. I still win. Pop rocks on the outside. Surely not. No, <laughs> reversed. But that's good. That means she just wasted her comeback. And there's that big spot. Come on! Do it! <laughs> if she does this, she's gonna win my count out. No, don't, don't, just win my count out. Alright, get back in the ring and pin it in. Quickly. What, what? No, what? No, no, down, down. Oh, wait, okay, whatever. And pin. Come on. And is that it? Gig out. Oh, no! She kicked out! <laughs> oh, Son of a bitch! Oh, oh, oh. That's it. Oh, no, That's it. Rocks. That's it! Yes! In the ropes! Please. In the ropes! She's in the ropes! Oh, she oh. Out of that! She's going for some sort of springboard. Uh. Drop down. Arm drag. Cow bomb. Stop the ankle. Rocks end to the top. Wants her up. Cross body connects. What is she doing? Just walking. Back up. Moonsault connects as well. And goes for a pin. Come on, that's it. That's it. She's worn out. She's done. She's finished. Yes! Up three one, the great up three two, the greatest comeback. He's alive, and it comes down to the main event. We will have a winner. Yep. We'll either I'll win or we'll draw. Yep. And if we draw, I win. Yes. Well, with that, we'll be back with the main event after this final break. And we're back with the main event. It's a special guest ref match for the NXT title. Ethan Page, Joe Hendry, who do you have? In game, I'm taking Ethan Page. And in real life, I think Joe Hendry's going to win. You think Hendry? They, yeah, they're going to give the NXT title to a TNA dude. I think but I'm I, picking... I really think that's going to happen too. But I'm going to take Ethan Page from both, I think. Uh, hang on, who did you pick? Ethan Page. I'll take Andrew in game then. And the winner wins for us. Yeah. So, you've decided to take who I've got in real life in game, and I've got and in game. <laughs> so, yep. yeah. Ethan Page is going to win in game. 
I don't know who's going to win in the game. Honestly, I was quite happy to take either. <laughs> yeah, I was too, to be honest. Yeah. But. So. Do we think Trick Williams will be ejected as special guest ref? What? Do you think that Trick Williams will be ejected as special guest ref in the game? No. No? He'll be a good boy. <laughs> I He'll don't behave. think I've ever seen a referee, AI referee, be ejected. Do you... Yeah, probably not. They probably probably because they just try and do a good job all the time. Yeah. What if you turn the meter off? Do you reckon if you turn the meter off, then they stuff up more because there's no consequences? I don't know if you can turn the meter off. Yeah, you can. Can you? Yeah. No, I don't. Then you can do ref matches where you can literally do whatever you want. Yeah, right. And you never get penalised for it. Yeah. Wish I had known that. It's in the first, like when you go to match match rules but there's it's the first section oh, yeah. so like you don't go into the match rules yet it's before that where you have like the entrance and yeah. you pick the arena and the referee and like all that stuff yeah. it's down the bottom of that I think oh, right. it just says ref meter yeah. Yeah. I'll did Joe Hendry have EC3's thing just then? Yes, he just had EC3's entrance. <laughs> right, I... Where he turns his head around. So technically, it's he's not wrong. No, no, it's, it's quite correct. What I love is going on Facebook or Twitter or whatever, you scroll through all the reels, and there's so many people going, who the hell is Joe Hendry? Yeah. Because <laughs> there's just all these memes <laughs> with Joe Hendry. I watched one last night. It was uh, Peter Griffin in the car crying. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, Joe Hendry's theme come on and he's just happy again. <laughs> so anyway, here is a page. Your pick to win in game. Yep. My pick to win in real life. Now, this match is very 50-50, I believe. For both, I, I think. Yeah. Yeah, in-game, I have no idea. And in real life, I have no idea. Oh, they could genuinely give the fucking belt to Hendry. Yeah. It would be and crazy if, if they did. Honestly, if they did, that would be smart. For multiple reasons. Like, obviously, Hendry's like the biggest thing in the wrestling. But TNA just recently neglected to give him their belt. True. So it'd be funny if WWE yeah. gave it to him instead. Yeah. Yeah, I will say you did with the TNA World Championship. Here's the NXT Championship. <laughs> Plus, it's not that core either. Hendry's? Yeah. Mm. holding a belt that he is very familiar with. Okay. Nice body slam to start us off. And an ankle lock. And trick. Coles for, the, Coles for the bell. Coles for the bell. <laughs> Screw job. Joe Hendry wins. Yeah. Hendry. Loving blow to the back. 
neck break. Two already. Kicks him off. So, drop kick to the floor. Henry back in. And immediately punches him in the mouth. And Bulldog! Oh no. Let's straight back up. That's what? <laughs> back over. That's nice. Back in. Two. Should have fast scared of it. Oh. Angle lock again. Right by the leg. Right by the leg. Oh, nice reversal there. From Hendry. Up the top. Cross body to the outside. Referee Trick Williams hasn't started on the count yet. Isn't going to start a count? <laughs> Probably not. Ring oh, count not started. He got in trouble. Yeah. One. <laughs> He's a Ooh, nice open. Get in the ring. <laughs> Andrea has had the, pretty much all of this match. They've been outside for so long. Yeah, I know. Base press on the apron. Trick Willie at seven. Andrew now decides to get him back in the Hey, that's it! <laughs> One count. Oh! Andrew oh. must have opened it. There was the pump kick for a two. Both men must have opened out. He goes edge. Reversed. Standing ovation! Oh, oh yes. Hendry to the second. Diving knee. This Hendry call looks real. Yeah. No. Oh. Oh. It's like as soon as he does a normal move, I betcha. Yeah. Oh, he was going for something there. Oh, what a big kick from Ethan Page. Three, three, three. I just got it. Got to finish her. Yes. Yeah. This will be it. There he goes, Edge. Come on, come on, come on. He's gonna hit it. He hit it into the ropes, though. Yeah. Imagine if it threw him over the top rope. Rope right, break. Rope right, right, break. Win me the belt. Win me the belt. Yes. The greatest comeback of all time has been completed. I told you. I told you. And you. Four straight matches. How do you feel? This is bullshit. Where was the rope break? He was clearly in the ropes. Absolutely. Oh, that shit. was wonderful. That's it for this bloody stupid shit commentary shit. Like, share, scrub, channel, notification bell, follow Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, TikTok, links those in the description. Um, yeah, let me know what you thought. We had some good matches. We had some bullshit bloody referee from stupid friggin' Trick Williams. Woo! Cost me my belt. Um, and yeah, other than that, Carl, say goodbye. Goodbye. Frick.
and good night.